Hi there, and welcome to another video, Year 9s, on the unitary method. This is video 2. Um, please write classwork, the title, and the date. In this video, we're going to find out how much any number of items cost, given how much several items cost in total. So we're moving up a, a slightly harder level than the last video. Right, so by that, I mean I'm going to say to you something like, five CDs cost, uh, I don't know, £60. How much are 11 CDs? That's the type of thing we're working towards. But I've done it in a broken down way for you. So here we go. Let's do it first example. Write this down. Example one. Four CDs cost £20. How much does or do one CD cost, two CD cost, and seven CDs cost? So what we're going to do always, uh, we're going to, for part one, we're always going to find out what one CD costs. So we're going to draw ourselves the usual picture. There's our picture. And we know that four CDs cost £20. So the whole of this is £20. And so we're going to split it into four. One, two, three, four. So how much does each CD cost? Well, the number that must go in here must be five. Okay, so um, that's our initial working. So for part one, how much is one CD? Well, clearly one CD is one box, so it's five pounds. Now, this is obviously an easy question now, having done the first part. How much are two CDs? Well, two CDs must be two boxes, so it must be ten pounds. Okay, and what are seven CDs? Well, seven CDs must be seven boxes. So you can imagine here, if you're struggling doing this, you can draw yourself out a little picture and you can divide it into seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, sorry, done that wrong there. So it would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And uh, you, you know that in each box, each CD costs five pounds. So it would be five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. So clearly it's 35 pounds for seven CDs. And we're done. That's how we how we do those type of questions. Okay, let's have a go at another one. Um, example two, write this down. Now, five CDs cost 35 pounds. How much are one CD, three CDs and 10 CDs? The first thing we're going to do is draw a picture. So here's our picture and the whole lot is £35, and there are five CDs, so we're going to split it into five, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, now what must go in each box to add up to 35? What equal number must go in each box? Well, you can do it, you can see that it must be seven, because seven, 14, 21, 28, and 35, okay? So then we can answer our questions using this. Uh, question one, one CD is one box, so it must be seven pounds. What about three CDs? Well, three CDs are three boxes, so seven, 14, 21 pounds. And 10 CDs, well, you know, if we, if we are struggling with this sort of idea, all you've got to do is draw yourself a box there, split it into 10, so, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And you know that um, 7 goes in each box. So, 7, 14, 21, 28, 35, uh, 42, 49, 56, si uh, 60, sorry, 63, and 70. So, therefore, 10 CDs must be 70 pounds, or 10 lots of seven, 10 times seven, which is 70. One more example, then a few for you to do yourself. Copy this down. So we have six CDs, and they cost 54 pounds. Let's draw a picture. There's our CDs. All of them together cost 54 pounds. Okay, and we've got six of them. So we're gonna split them into one, two, three, four, five, six. What must go in each box? Well, let's think, could it be 10? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, no, too big. So let's go for nine. And it turns out nine works because nine 
18, 27, 36, 45 and 54. So now let's answer the question. Question 1, how much is one CD? Well, one CD is one box, so it's £9. How much would four CDs cost? Well, that would be four boxes, so 9, 18, 27, 36. So it'd simply be £36. And lastly, eight CDs, how much would they cost? Well, it would be eight boxes of nine. Okay, so you could count it up simply. You need to draw a picture. Um, it would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Each of them would be nine. So there would be nine in each box like that. And you just count them up if you want. So nine, 18, 27, 36, 45, 54, 63, and 72. So it would be 72 pounds. Another nice way of spotting it, well, if you know four CDs are 36, then eight CDs are twice that, so you could have times that number by two, if you were clever. Okay? So now time for you to do a few questions yourself, and then that's the end of this particular video, and we'll move on to harder unitary method questions in video three and four. So here are the questions for you to do. Pause the video now and work through these, and I'll mark them in class. Thank you for watching.